Hey, it's Andy from SmartWP, and today we're gonna to show you how to find broken links on your WordPress site using a plugin. Plus, we're gonna show you how to fix them. It's really simple, so let's hop right in. So you can see we're on our WordPress site here. Uh, we're already logged in, so let's head over to the admin. Uh, so we're gonna add a plugin for this. So we're gonna to go to Plugins, Add New. And the plugin we're gonna use is called Broken Link Checker. So we'll just type Broken Link here. And you can see the plugin here by WPMU Dev. So let's install it. And let's activate it. Before we hop into the settings of this plugin, we're gonna go over to our homepage. And you can see we have a list of links here uh, to SmartWP, Google, and a broken link example. And you can see that the plugin has already done a little bit of work. It has put a line through the broken link here. So that indicates to your users that the link is broken. Now let's go back and show the admin dashboard settings for this. So we're just gonna head over to settings, link checker. And now you can see the plugin has already found one broken link. Um, let's go look at that link real quick. And you can see it's the broken link we saw on the homepage and uh, it's server not found error. And it says what post it's in. The best thing about this plugin is you'll probably have a few broken links here and you can easily uh, select uh, edit URL if you wanna actually make it go to a correct URL. Um, you can also unlink the link. You can also indicate that it's not broken. I've found that this is an issue with some Amazon links. It'll pop up as broken when they're not. Um, you can dismiss the notification or you can uh, recheck the link, which in our case, the link is still broken. So we're gonna edit the link and make it go to a real site here, yahoo.com. And we can uh, change the link text even, and we'll update the link. Now let's head over back to our homepage. And you can see it's updated the link in the context. So if you have a lot of broken links, this is a really easy and efficient way to go through them quickly. So let's go ahead over and look at a few more settings in the link checker. You can see that it'll check link, broken links every 72 hours um, and you can get email notifications and you can also disable the formatting where it puts the line through the link that I showed earlier. I actually don't prefer this setting because it might be confusing if the link is working and it puts that on top of the link when it is a working link because I have seen it pop up on things like Amazon links incorrectly. So we'll turn that off. And one great thing about this plugin is that it'll also look for links in comments. Now I've noticed a lot of sites that have comments, for example, from like 2015, people's links might be broken. So by default, the plugin will look through comment URLs and this is a great way to remove people's links that may go to broken sites now. And one of the best features of this plugin is that it actually sends you alerts to your email if there's a broken link found. So, you know, obviously links will break over time. So here's an example of the email it sends you. It just tells you the link and where it is and what the link text is. And you can quickly click here and just go in and fix that broken link. If you're really worried about broken links, you could also change the uh, link checker to every 24 hours instead of 72. And that's it. We found all the broken links in our site and fixed them quickly and easily with the broken link checker plugin. Uh, we hope this video was helpful. Remember to like and subscribe and thanks for watching. And if there's anything in the future that you'd want to see us do a video on, let us know in the comments below. Thanks.